A number of people are taking the anti-parasitic ivermectin meant for livestock to help treat their COVID-19. Now, the FDA warns taking the drug, though, could come with some severe symptoms. But there are versions of the drug that's approved for humans. News Channel 5's Amelia Young live from our newsroom this morning. Uh, so, Amelia, why do experts say, though, that they still shouldn't be used to treat COVID? Yeah, Ben, well, FDA officials say they're not surprised that people have turned to treatments that are not yet approved or authorized. And because of that, they want to send out these warnings just to make sure people understand the dangerous risks that are involved. We've talked a lot about ivermectin for animals such as horses and livestock. Those formulas come as a pour on injectable paste and drench, which are approved to treat or prevent parasites in animals not COVID-19 for either humans nor animals. The FDA says there are people with ivermectin prescriptions, but those are approved at very specific doses to treat some parasitic worms. And there are topical formulas for head lice and skin conditions like rosacea. Current data does not show ivermectin is effective against COVID-19. Experts say even for the levels of the drug approved for human uses, that can still interact with other medications like blood thinners. You can also overdose to some degree, which can cause a slew of symptoms like nausea, vomiting, seizures, a coma, and even death. Now, recently, the Tennessee Poison Center says in a single week, they received 12 calls from people who took that drug as a treatment for COVID-19 that were experiencing severe symptoms. And they say that number of people taking it continues to grow. Back to you in the studio. All right.